so we're discussing about this today. Got the handle. And we have a little guest star, this is my cat. Kitty, kitty. Let's get to it. Okay, so obviously this is a cart that I got on Amazon. And I'm gonna tell you why I got it and what are the pros and cons. So I got this around like 100 bucks or so, but all the things I'll be showing you today will be on Amazon and it will be in the description down below. And excuse me for not having my hair up all fancy, I haven't showered. Don't judge me just yet. So anyway, first thing you need to know, this is a clicker thing, I use it to record, is that this closes and opens very easily. It's very light and it has four wheels. Okay, so if I go right here, you can probably see it. The big wheels right here in the bottom, right here, the big ones and the small ones. So the thing is when you go out, when you have this, if you have to walk on location with this, you can have to do this, like kind of like a lawnmower to go to place to place, or you can do all fours. Personally, since I have this for a couple months now, I prefer to do it like this, like a little really kind of way. It makes it easier to go to place to place if you go this. And um, if we do all fours, it does get a little noisy and it's really annoying sound it makes, but it's really up to you. So I prefer to go like this and um, yeah. Um, and also, if you do take this to the store, you can just go back down to all four legs and just go like this. And just go all over the store with it on. On the, <laughs> all fours, and it's really cool. So, yes, that is why I have this. Because I need it. Also, when you are in the store with this, you can put your basket right here sideways or up ways or whatever. I put it right here was the basket so I can put my things in the basket with my cart. So that's another thing you can look forward to when you have this. And my kitty just walked past me. Wonderful. Okay, the second most important thing to know that you should have a protector. This. I know it looks small, but trust me, it is so big. So if you live in a state like me or region or whatever you live at, my cat. <laughs> um, and it's rainy or just plain sunny or it's windy or whatever, you need to have at least a protection um, cover for your shopping cart for this. So this is like 12, 13 bucks. I have no idea, I forgot. But it is um, removable and you can put it in anytime you want. So every time I go to the store, these are one of the essentials I have to take with me because I don't want people to see what I got from the store or it's raining. It is waterproof. I believe it's cotton. It's very nice. It does have these whip a tear zip, um, zip stuff. So it'll be nice, easy to attach to the shopping cart. So I'm going to put this in to show you what it looks like. And this is like a large, I believe it comes in different sizes, but mostly it's a large. And you can use the straps right here to strap it in to make sure it doesn't move a lot. So, yeah, and then it does have the cover, okay? The cover go with it, and there's some in the bottom. You need to make sure it's all stretched and you can easily flip it over. So, to protect yourself from the elements, and from people who want to stare at you saying, what did I got? Why do you have so much stuff in your cart? Or whatever. And there's also straps in the back. Right here. So you can strap on the back of it too. So you can be nice and sturdy. So that's why I prefer to take this when I go out. No matter what the weather is. Because you don't know what I'm going to buy. Or <laughs> I'm going to buy. So yes. That's why I would recommend buying this to go with your cart. Okay, so here's another thing you need to know about this cart. It has a nice firm grip on the handle right here. So it's nice and foam, so you don't get like 
the meta bar and it gets really uncomfortable later. So it's nice to have this. Also, you need to know that this has a basket. A basket you can put in my hand for here, just see how thick it is and how it's nice and sturdy. It comes with it and it's also affordable. Um, pets cannot go inside to <laughs> my cat. <laughs> cannot go in the cart because there's too many big holes or freak out. I noticed because my cat stupidly got in the cart <laughs> and she freaked out and I had to get her out of the cart so she doesn't break her bones. And anyway, um, this little basket has this cool little thing right here. I don't even know what it's for. I'm guessing for holding like umbrella with a little um, loop or something. They keep it sturdy. So, yeah, but it does not hold your purse, really. It holds like things like water bottles, umbrellas, small items, but not too small that go straight through it because the holes are like this big between the wires and they're all cube, square looking kind of wet. But yeah, I would use this, this little pocket for something, but it does not have a cover for your pocket for this side. Sadly, it doesn't, okay? Now, I'm going to talk about this. This, I would recommend buying if you have a cell phone or water. It holds your cell phone in your water, but you don't have, you don't like it, put it in here. And like, you don't like it when it falls down the sideways. So what I'm going to do is show you how to put this on, which is pretty easy. Which you need to open this, like loosen it up, put it on the shopping cart, and then tighten it up. So... Yeah, I'm good. Put it in the shopping cart right here on the handle. So right here on the handle. I forgot you can't see me from way up there. Put it up here. Put it in position you want to put it in. I recommend putting it in the middle of your handle and you twist it on. That's all you need to do. Twist it on all the way. And then because it's coming with loose, I have to make sure it's nice and tight. It does squeak a little. Sounds like a bird. Anyway, um, so I put it right here on my handle. So see how it is right here? So the water bottle here and the phone goes right here. Kind of fix my fingers. I put it in the middle between where my hands are when I have a nice grip on the cart when I go shopping. So every time I go to get something from the store or whatever, um, I have to have this with me because I have to have water and my cell phone and I don't want to put it in my pocket because it might fall or right here because I know it would not stay stable. So I do recommend buying this little thing. It goes well with like a baby shopping cart, <laughs> a baby stroller, shopping cart now. <laughs> and it does save a lot of time and it's very cheap and it's very useful. I recommend buying it. Okay, so another thing you know that when you have this, it does have many perks. It is great for any age. It could be able to use to go not only shopping, but only like going camping or helping with the laundry if you live in an apartment unit or complex, whatever you want to call it. And um, it's very safe, sturdy, and it's easy to store. <laughs> to store. Ah, can't talk to um, put away because it's collapsible, be very easy to put away. And I had this for a couple months now, it has no problems, none of the wheels came off, and I actually love having this. So many reasons why you should take this with you, especially if you have a bad back or you don't have a car or you want something easier for you to carry things to or from because you don't want your hands to be all purple and red because of by like, holding like tote bags or plastic bags or whatever but yeah i do recommend buying this so much because it saves so much time and energy and i don't have to take one of the shopping carts from the store where car <laughs> where it hasn't been clean and I don't know who's been touching it and I'm especially when this whole COVID or diseases or viruses out now these days I prefer to have something that's mine only mine and I can take it to the store and not and get in trouble and back home because I can take it with me because it is mine because I bought it so 
Now here's the other things you need to know about it. Okay, here's another thing you need to know. The bottom is kind of loose right here. I don't know if you can see that, but it's kind of loose. But then again, it is thin bars. And also there is no flat top. When I mean flat as in it does not have like a flat surface. So you have to buy something to keep your groceries flat. So my cat is in the background just playing with something. I don't know what it is. And so I recommend buying like a tote bag that has a heavy bottom. What I mean that is that something like this. I got this at Fred Myers, at my local Fred Myers. And my cat's playing with a feather, whatever. I'm not even gonna bother to edit this out or kick her out of the room because she would just come in and do whatever she wants. Anyway, um, it is a cardboard kind of tote bag. On the bottom right here is pretty soft, as you can see. But right here is the heavy part, the like board part, and you put it in, put it inside the cart, this little <laughs> fat tote bag so it's nice and sturdy so any heavy items you want to put in in this shopping cart make sure you buy something kind of like this so you can put in like heavy things from milk to laundry detergent or something even heavier i don't know and these have side pop like side handles at the bottom this does fit in this cart but <laughs> Hard thing is to try to get it out and in, but I do recommend getting something like this so they have something flat in the bottom so it doesn't like damage any food or any other items they got from the store or around the house. So if I show you like this, it kind of does struggle a bit, but it's worth it and it does get to the bottom of the cart. See? So it's nice and sturdy, and I can take my things to it, to and from. I do recommend getting like a couple other tote bags when you take this to the store. Make sure you take it cover if you want to, but take this, heavy things in the bottom, in this bag, heavy things. And then when you have light things like light food or clothes, you layer on top within each other in this basket saves so much time okay so that's something you also need to think about so next part okay so this is the next part this is my purse i take my purse with me all the time and this is also on amazon that i got too love it amazing the sad part it doesn't have any pockets side pockets right here to hold my water bottle or cell phone or whatever that's what I have this for, which you can't see right now because I'm out of frame. But also, I can use it when if I get um, tired from my shoulder, I can just put it in here or inside the basket and boom. Easy fit, small, capable, and I don't have to worry about being stolen because I can take off the strap and put it in right here with a little hoop and it'll be nice and secure. So I recommend that. Plus this and a few other tote bags with me that I can easily fold or put away in my purse. When I mean foldable tote bags, I mean things things like these. Um, these are foldable tote bags, 99 cents. I got them at my local friend Myers, of course. This is Valentine's bag themed. It's nice, plastic, reusable. And I can just put this in here too, whether it's like this. Or if I haven't used it yet, I can fold it up, put it in here, in the small bag, or here. Because if there's some room in here, like this much room, I can put things in it. So, anything is nice and, uh, nice and secure in this basket and in the bags. So, sometimes when I go out in my, my bag here, my big one, my sturdy one, is an out. I'll put this in the bottom, open it up like this, this way, like this little measurement, and then put it straight in the bottom. Then I put my bags and my purse right here at the bottom of the shopping cart. The reason is because where I live and you need to walk on the sidewalk or walk on the grass, it will get dirty and your purse will get dirty and some of your stuff will get dirty. So I'm putting this in the bottom 
of the shopping cart will save you time and money from getting, not getting your stuff wet. So I'm gonna put this back in here where it's nice and safe and secure. So anyway, that's the whole video and my kitty. You say hi to you little followers? No? No. Anyway. Cat hair in my mouth. So, sorry. Anyway, um this is a cart I will buy when I need to move out. I can put things in here and take it there so I know exactly where it is and I don't have to whack my back or have higher movers. <laughs> Um, so they don't have to lose my stuff. So I do recommend buying this. It's very expensive with accessories, but I do recommend buying it if you live by yourself or if you live in the compacts or apartment or whatever, or, or just you don't have a car or you don't want to take a shopping cart in the store and then have to walk home with no shopping cart and have purple hands on your way back home because that would be unfair. So all the things I showed you are available on Amazon, except for like this, this bag, the heavy bag, and this, the Valentine's bag, because I got those in the store. But I really hope you understand that I'm showing this, you, this, your, my audience, this, because it is the best essential thing I ever got, and the best investment ever, it really is. So... One more thing you need to know on the big wheels like I showed you in the beginning of the video does get dirty like mud dirt muddy just plain muddy because I do always this which isn't a bad thing but I do recommend walking on a sidewalk or side of the road with this and it's nice and stable when you do the whole you know really thing but the back of the tires do get a little um, muddy so if you're done putting things away you want to take it outside or in the bathroom and clean it with just plain water or with a damp towel because that will clean it off just fine but you just gotta be careful because one time I accidentally rolled over dog poop that didn't turn out well for me <laughs> but yeah I did have to go outside hose it down on the back of the wheels and the whole thing so I don't have to have that dog's poop smell on my car <laughs> so anyway that is the whole video i hope you guys enjoyed it because i have fun making this and i love this thing to death because it saves so much time and effort for me and i don't have to order a lift because before i have to um order a lift to take me um back home after i'm done shopping and it costs like so much money these days now <laughs> and I wish I had this when I first moved out because before it cost me like 40 or 50 bucks <laughs> just to get back home with groceries but yes these this and accessories are definitely something I recommend on buying when you're moving out on your own or going to college it saves so much time and energy and you don't have to break your back <laughs> so um, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time